Pioneers, designed by Emmanuel Ornella and published by Queen Games, plays in 60 minutes, has a double-sided game board to adjust nicely for two to four players ages eight and up. The object of the game is to move your pioneers out of Boston in the east across the American continent, heading west by stagecoach, advantageously laying roads and placing your pioneers in burgeoning cities looking for specific skills. There's money to be made and gold to be found. The catch, all players are directing the one stagecoach. The direction a player moves the stagecoach on their turn may not be the direction you want to go. At the beginning of the game, the setup looks like this. The pioneer and hotel tokens are randomly placed on the map. All players begin with a starting coach to which they add five pioneer pawns in their player color. These five illustrations on the coach relate to a job and where a specific type of pioneer can be placed on the map. Coaches in the draw stack are smaller and show at most four jobs and at least two. The number at the top of the stage coach are victory points a player is awarded when all pioneer pawns are placed on the map. A player's turn consists of three phases represented on their player board. Phase one is banking. The beginning income is $3 with the opportunity to increase this income during the game. Phase two is to purchase roads or one of the face-up coaches. At the start of the game, a player may only make one purchase. This too can be increased during the game. Phase three is movement and colonizing. The player board breaks down what is done during this phase into three steps. One, pay to move the stagecoach. When moving the stagecoach, money is paid to another player or the common supply. Two, colonize a city. The stagecoach must stop when they come to a city containing a pioneer token. The player must place a pioneer pawn matching the same job as the pioneer token and then takes the pioneer token from the map. Some of these tokens give the player a permanent special action. Some give the player an immediate special action. Three, one other player can add a pioneer to this spot. In clockwise direction, the active player asks each player if they would like to place a pioneer in this city. Once a player says yes, no other players are asked. It is possible for all players to pass on this opportunity. The game ends when at least one player has constructed all their roads and or the stack of coaches is depleted. End game scoring consists of the points shown on the empty coaches. If a coach still has a pioneer on it, the player only gains one victory point per empty space on that coach. Each player gains two victory points for each pioneer connected to their own largest contiguous road network. We at Queen Games hope you've enjoyed this brief overview of pioneers.